Well, Bellringer fans, Living Environment fans, I'm finally back from my quarantine and isolation from my bout of COVID. So we've been treading water here for about a week, and so I'm going to get back into it. The second quarter has started. Uh, we're going to do a number of things. One of the things we're going to do is we'll get some new seats. And then after we get new seats, um, we're going to go back and we're going to talk more about cell membranes, active transport, passive transport, those kinds of things. That's what we're doing. And then uh, we'll come back to immune system and immunity uh, as we go. So, yeah, let's do this here, bell ringer. And then we'll get back to class. <laughs> Mr. Kovacs class. It's Mr. Kovacs class. You might learn how to talk. It's Mr. Kovacs class. He's interested too. It's Mr. Kovacs class. And he's super cool. It's Mr. Kovacs class. All right, we talk a little about cell membrane. It controls what goes into and out of cells. And of course, we've learned that it's made up of lipid. Lipid it actually forms this bilayer of lipids um, where the hydrophobic tails get together and hydrophilic heads get together. So you get this nice double layer membrane. Then embedded in the, the plasma membrane is uh, our proteins. And protein molecules have a lot of different jobs. That's what we're going to focus on today. What are the jobs of, of membrane proteins? All right, so what are the job of those membrane proteins? They have a number of jobs, and we're going to talk about them in class today a little bit more, but um, they really do one of two things. They either work as a transport. They go allow things in and out, like gate or an opening through the cell membrane so that things can go in and out of the cell, or they work kind of as a... Um, ID tag or marker, a little communication portal for the cell. So those are the two main jobs of the of the membrane-bound proteins. Okay, and um, yeah, membrane proteins. Uh, of course, if you paid attention last week, you know that the antigens are the like the little proteins that stick out the top that give cells their ID, and that's what keeps um, our how our immune system can recognize foreign invaders. All right, so today uh, we're gonna do some notes about cell membrane. Um, what else we got for you? We've got, uh, yeah, a couple other things. If you have lab today, we're gonna do another lab with a different enzyme called catalase. And then hopefully we'll be back on track here for our normal uh, regular program. All right, 